Welcome back to Home Entertainment. Before we meet our next guest, we're going to take a look at a story about an art exhibit in downtown Okemos. I knew they were prodigies right away. At an art class in downtown Okemos, the owner discovered two boys whose art stood out from the rest. I taught K through 12 for a while, and that age all draw things pretty similar. Some are better than others, where their line was like something I learned in college. Dwyer says their attention to detail separated them from other nine-year-olds. Lewis just has to look at a flower once and he can um, remember it. He doesn't even need it in front of him. And she says that's where the prodigy comes in. And it was just in his brain. It was like, you know, like a computer had the motherboard. <laughs> he, had, he had what he knew. He knew what he had to do and it just was there already. He never learned it from anyone. It was just in him. Max and Lewis have different styles of art. They're both very talented, but they can't do what the other one does. Max just likes to do bugs. He likes to use pen and ink, a little bit of color. Um, he likes to do any creatures uh, where Lewis will only paint flowers and trees. And she says this is something that everyone should witness. People should really see this because prodigies are very rare but identical twin prodigies, I don't believe they exist. And two years later, they are award-winning artists with their own art exhibit. They've won awards all over the country um, in adult shows. Uh, the jurors have no idea that they're children and they enter them and they get in and they win awards. Even Dwyer is surprised about how far they've come. I mean, I didn't think they can get much better than last year, but they're, they are, they're a lot better and they, they just keep learning. In Okemos, Jasmine Watts, Home TV. Vivian Dwyer opened up Artie Party Studio around five years ago in downtown Okemos. Today we are joined by Max and Lewis, and they are artists, and she helped discover you. Thank you so much for joining Thank us you. on the show Thank today. You. So tell us about um, how you got started. Well, we first got started when we were um, nine, when we started going to Arty Party. But then before that, we always were into art. And then when we were introduced to a nature camp, we started actually like learning about nature and all that fun stuff. So then we got, I got into insects, and then Lewis got into flowers. Yeah, well, you have a lot of um, really detailed artistry that you've done with insects and that you've mm -hmm. done with flowers. Thank you. Thank you. So. Did you collaborate and say, hey, I'm going to do bugs and hey, I'm going to do flowers? Or it was no, just, well, we didn't um, really know, but we just, it just I know, came just, to me yeah. when, um, one day when I, I, I finished a painting and then I just thought, wow, it'd be really cool to do an insect. How did you start with art? Did you start with pencils, colored pencils, markers? Well, well we started with pencil because that was like at school and we would always get our hands on pencils and then we just do... Um, drawings and paintings. I never really liked colored pencils because you couldn't exactly do that much detail with them yeah. and the color was not that great so then I just really liked pencils. So okay. were you drawing during class <laughs> while the teacher was talking? Yeah, yeah. sometimes. <laughs> I so a doodle and, and came into a masterpiece. Yeah. yeah. I can see that because when you're an artist you, you, you have creativity sometimes your mind you know takes yeah. shape and you want to draw out what you're imagining in mm -hmm. your mind and so you know I went to uh, uh, LCC as, as an artist so I understand you know the need to really draw mm -hmm. everything uh -huh. that you're thinking about so how, how, um, how has Artie Party Studio or Vivian how Vivian Dreyer how has she helped uh, bring out the artist in you well she she helped us discover like our true talent and mm -hmm. well we really we really didn't know we were that good. Well, I <laughs> thought I was, but my mom. Good for you. Like, well, and then she, and then we really started doing art later. Okay. Okay. Do you show your your artistry anywhere? Is it up yeah. on display? Um, we have it in galleries everywhere, and we've won awards. You wow. have. What do, what do you know the names of the awards that you've won? So we got national awards in adult competitions. So wow, we, goodness. And we let's did, clarify, you, yeah. so you, you received national awards mm -hmm, mm -hmm. in adult competitions, yeah. yet you're sixth graders, uh -huh. you're 11? Yeah, we're yeah. 11. You're yeah. 11 year, years old and you've you done won it for a, three years? Two um, years. Two years. Two, two years. years and you've won adult competitions. Uh -huh. That's fantastic. <laughs> that's amazing. That's, that's really good. 